What is up, YouTubers? John's here, and welcome back to Bakugan. Um, yeah. It's been quite a while since we've actually played this for the main, uh, channel and stuff. I know currently, um, going online right now is, um, the Bakugan Battle Brothers NBP? NBP? What is it? Snow Partner? Uh, dis yeah, it's the NPD. Yeah. Which was the No Partner Disadvantage Challenge. And, uh, yeah, I know that's going on at the moment, but, uh, yeah, this is a different save file. Um, you know, we're mostly just gonna have fun on this little series. This is kind of a new series at the same time. I know, um, in the past, way, like, around the start of this channel, I, uh, you know, why don't I put the freaking volume down a little bit? I feel like it might be too loud a bit. I think 6 is fine for now. But, um, yeah, long ago, when I first started this channel, I started, uh, my first playthrough of this game, and then after that, I started another playthrough, which was on the Chaos one. My first one was Pyrus, then I did Chaos, and then I went on to Aquas, then I went on to Terra, then I went on to v uh, Ventus, and then Darkus for the final one. And, uh, yeah, and this series, we're just gonna kind of mess around, have some fun in this, uh, thing, do tournaments and stuff, maybe have random battles, you know, just kind of build up and stuff, because, you know, why not? Um, I'm kind of at that point where, at some points, there are games I like to try to play again, but, like, do them as a series again, eh, I mean, some of them, yeah, I would have to, but, like, in some cases and some other ones, I could just go and do progress on a game and, you know, have some fun with it for once, because normally I always do, like, series stuff. This is kind of like a series, but, like, you know, more like one that has no end, unless I want there to be an end, but, uh, yeah. Anyways, without further ado, we're gonna get things going. Um, I kinda saw who I was gonna be going up against in this next tournament, and it's on the Ventus field, so I know that much. I think I might want to finish off this tournament first. I don't even know if I've even finished this uh, tournament yet. But yeah, I'm facing Masquerade next. And yes, I'm playing on the Superior Wii version. And uh, yeah, okay, so we have Darkus. Okay, um, do I want to switch? That's an Aquas team. Uh, yeah, let's switch things up a bit. And yeah, I have Darkest Leonidas for uh, this one. Uh, maybe I should go with something like Ventus. Or something, I don't know. I could also uh, mess around a little bit and make some sort of different team. Like, I could put Skyrus down for one of them. Maybe like Flatator as another, and then maybe we can have a different type here. Uh, how about... Well, I don't want to put Zotera. How about Aquas? I mean, actually, if I put something like Angelo and Diabolos in there, they are different Titans as well. Yeah, I think they'll be fine. Okay, uh, I'm gonna have that. Um, this is gonna change over to... If your background attribute is different than your opponent's. I mean, that means Flatator wouldn't be able to... Well, maybe then, maybe we should switch from Flatator. Yeah, you know what? Let's switch from Flatator or something. I mean, no offense, Flatator, but if we're going up against Darkus, then you might want to change you out. Uh, someone's maxed out here, which is Normal Tigra. So let's just go with Claw Tigra. Okay. There you go. I didn't want to go with uh, Drago or anything because, well, there's a certain card I like to use, and, uh, yeah. Um, maybe, I'm not sure about this one. I mean, we do have Ventus, but, uh, oh yeah, no, wait, I have something else here that would actually work. Or, do I even have it yet? That's the real question. Each Darkest, uh, no, not that one. Or no, maybe, I don't know, it was, it was this one, okay. Um... So each Bakugan used by a player who is using all different attributes gets 200. And yeah, all my Bakugan are different attributes no matter what they are. Um, yeah. Okay, so yeah, we'll pick that one. Uh, we want to pick something that Darkest is not good against. 
Um, but let's see. Uh, I gotta also remember what I have. Uh, yeah, okay. So, still nothing. I mean, hmm. Wait, hold on. Yes, actually this one, because uh, I gotta remember um, Diablos is... Yeah, okay, that's fine. And then we gotta switch up the metal, metal cards. Do I even have Storm Skyrus? I do have Storm Skyrus, perfect. Storm Skyrus is gonna be my go-to on this one. And there we go. We got our, uh... We got our new set ready to go. But yeah, like, I just wanna kinda mess around with different decks and stuff. Change up Bakugans once in a while. And, uh, yeah, let's go. I know it's one-on-ones. Okay, so I just started this tournament. Okay, so I didn't actually get fully into this tournament yet. Okay, makes sense. Makes sense. Oh, wait, did I change... Did I change one of my, uh, ability cards? I don't remember. I'm gonna have to reset. Um, I guess we'll just use Storm Skyrus first. Put that card down. Alright, so uh, let's start by going over this way. Go to New Storm Skyrus. Yeah, you really gotta also think about like the different cards and Bakugans you want for like different strategies and fun uh, mechanics that you can put in for this uh, game. Oh, god damn it. I don't want Fingle Finger of Fate. Whatever. I get what I get. I'll probably waste this. Well, it, you know, if he challenges me with one of his weaker Bakugan. If it's Hydranoid, then I think I'll save it. Um, okay, he's not facing me with uh, Hydranoid right away. A little scary, but whatever. I have backups and whatnot. Maybe I'll waste this right at the end. Just so it's not... Because Fingle Finger of Fate is really not helpful to like either side. It's just chance, random chance, and I hate it. <laughs> well, get fucked. Go on, use your ability cards. I dare you. Oh, wise guy. Okay, I did get that. Okay, perfect. Too bad I wasn't able to see his cards too, because I knew if he had his one card that had it for different attributes, I could have also went in with just full darkness and then he wouldn't be able to use that ability card. Alright, shoot him battle. Damn it. <laughs> oh no, I'm gonna lose. Boom. Oh, I almost hit a darkness one. Oh, who's gonna win now? Nice, one, four, three, two. Well, get destroyed. And one geek cow for me. Alrighty. Alrighty. Uh, let's see. Did... Okay, yeah. Um, just thinking the pirate. Oh, no, wait. Oh, I chose poorly. My bad. Uh, so this will have to be for Diablos. This one is for Tigrera. <laughs> um, I guess I'll put it here. Yeah, I'll put it there. And then I will get Tigrera to get on that card. And you'll see what that card does to uh, to my uh, Blade Tigrera. Oops, I missed one. I'll take G Power Booster. Oh, geez, Tigrera's fast. What did I upgrade her to? I know I uh, upgraded some of the Bakugan with their stats, too. 
Okay. Uh, what are you gonna do? I'm still kind of scared of your hydronoid. That is not hydronoid, so I'm not scared. And he's still going. I think that would be Fear Ripper. Oh, wait, I just realized what he has. Oh, God. I hate when the AIs get it. Actually, I do want you to miss now. Unfortunately, I don't think he's going to. Damn it. I could go ahead and fight him. And the thing is also, what I didn't realize long ago is that, uh, if you actually fight the, uh, opponent, then you can, uh, take their stuff as well. I mean, I got ability cards, he does too. I think my ability cards are better anyways. I think I will fight him, but I'm gonna grab some, uh, G-Power first. Since I don't trust him. Oh man, I missed the one of them again. Oh well. You have to do what you gotta do. Wee! Oh god. I'll challenge him, why not? Who knows, maybe a skate card might backfire on him. And hey, we'll give it a go, we'll see what we got. Plus, we win this, then I can either go for a double stand or whatnot. Oh. What's this one do again? Uh, Dual Hydronoid gets... Oh, okay. Oh, that's his character card, okay. He only gets 200 because he's Darkest, and um, Aquas is the best I can do. Oh god, he caught up quick. He's not going. Hmm. Thing is, I'm not comfortable with this. That's the thing, because... He has single finger of fate. I know, well, I might as well not waste it for this battle then. Because he's just going to use other ability cards. Okay, let's uh, give it a go, I guess. Okay, it's going for me right now. Okay, no. Okay, that went for me, awesome. Oh, I almost got a thousand, but it switched in last minute. Alright, but now I have G-Power Booster, which actually helps. Now, I know I don't get my 400 card, but... Still. If you want to come fight me, Masquerade, you'll be... You're more than welcome to. He also has Mirror on because of what I gave him. I'm kind of scared about Hydronoid, but I still feel like I can pull this off. Especially with my gate card and stuff as well. You want to fight me? I dare ya. What are you doing? No, come back and fight me. I mean, this character card's also gone. Mm, I'm still not sure. I think I'll play it safe and not... Hmm, interesting. <laughs> okay, uh, let's see... Yeah, I'll put that... I'll put it here. Why not? Alright, it should be safe, I guess. I'm gonna try the Ventus uh, Storm. This way I'm able to collect things a lot easier, too. I don't even have to move anything. I got a bit of more extra stuff, and now I got a shield. If you go for a double stand, then you're a dick. You're, then you're a bitch. You're a little bitch. You better fight me or else. I got two back gone ready for ya.
There you go. I mean, there's still a chance that you'll most likely still fight, or go to Hydranoi. Yes. No! Okay, he's aiming for me. Good. <laughs> That's what I want! That's what I wanted! Oh, now. Now you're screwed. You're gonna see the full force of my magnitude. Cause I got a back of gun that could use all different types of gig of, of ability cards. And you can only use two, and they're not even that good. I mean, one of them I know is the same, but still. Yeah, let's both use it. Why not? There you go, nothing's changed. Oh, you're not going anymore? Well, let's uh, do Destruction Meteor Storm. <laughs> Just getting the guaranteed wins are really fun. And then, uh, Turn of Fortune. I like this one. No, oh, okay, it wasn't really the best, but it can uh, do a roulette from, like, 0 to 400. But it's normally always a good one. One point away from 1600, you dick. Time in battle level 3. Okay, I'm gonna wait on the booster thing. Look at that. Twenty one seventy nine. And victory is mine. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> I appreciate the victory. And yeah, you get more uh back of gun points from uh and also another thing is destruction points. The more times you hit the uh those things that give you those items, like the G Power Booster and uh I already forgot the how did I forget it? It's the one I loathe. The question was the one I decided to waste. Um you can actually get a as you see it says times three. Um yeah, uh hit that many more times and it's literally that number times the number. Which is actually insane. Literally one point, I was just stalling someone out because they were kind of stuck trying to do the same thing. And I just decided to keep going with a certain turn, not land on a card, but like try to get so much destruction points. It was insane. I actually got a huge amount of points in that one time as well. It was insane. Who's my next opponent? Tell me who. Julio. Well, I definitely have to switch from Tigrera. That kind of sucks. I mean, then I can put on Flautor at least. Uh, I didn't mean to go there. Could go Leonidas. Yeah, fuck it, he's a pretty strong backer gun. Should I switch from Diablos as well? That's what I'm wondering. I mean. Either another Aquas Bakugan that might be strong enough, like, eh, I don't know about Sirenoid. Uh, Chaos wouldn't do because of that one certain thing. Um, maybe a Pyrus Bakugan, I think that might be handy. Normal Drago, we got Delta Dragonoid, eh, let's just go Delta Dragonoid. <laughs> the three most powerful evolved Bakugan. Alright, uh, so now we'll switch it up again. The ability cards are fine, that's fine. Uh, the middle card is what I want to change. So we're going up against Chaos. And I think that's about good. <laughs> I mean, let's just see if there's any weaker ones. No. Now, actually, this one actually seems pretty good. If I'm being. Oh, wait, right, I forgot I have Ventus. Right, the. I gotta keep an eye on that too. Um, so what was the one? Yeah. This one. It's not as. 
good, but let me check again. So I'm just looking through thoroughly. So I remember. Okay, that one's more even. That's more good for chaos. That's 20. Oh, wait, I'm back here. I guess we'll just choose this one then. Alrighty. That's good. Let's uh, do it. Let's do it. I did. I reorganized my deck, me. Did it. Wow. Ah. Oh, yeah. Let's go, Julio. Yeah, and after game, like after the main story, um, whatever type of tournament you choose, it's always gonna be like five rounds. Oh yeah, and then funny enough, um, after the first two rounds, it's just nothing but the hard one. So uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, is it? Is it my turn? I could try something else with, like, more of normal backer gun or whatnot. Oh, no, I wanted Skyrus. Oh, I missed one again. I keep missing that. Well, on the day of recording this, this is Friday the 13th. Oh, god damn it. I got it. <laughs> Destruction. Yeah, I think I'll just go for the thing. And once again, I'll just waste a uh, single finger of fate. And yeah, since I hit two of them, uh, like I said, the destruction points, it would be 150 times two, so already I would get 300 uh, Bakugan points if I won. So there's that. Um, but uh, yeah. Uh, that is Tentaclair. No, it's not. Okay, never mind. That's uh, Falconeer. Fuck you. Well, too bad for your visibility card. <laughs> it wouldn't have worked because um, you'd have to be on a card all by himself. It only has effects if the Bakugan is on a card and stays out there. After this battle, that Bakugan's not going to be on the card. Well, I'm sorry to say, Julio, but uh, you might be fucked. He, he doesn't even have a Tentaclear card. Interesting. I'm pretty sure he has Tentaclear on his team. I'm pretty sure I saw that. Yo, he's just going for it. He's just going for it. Dude. to say, I mean, I know he's close, but I am Ventus, and this is only shooting battle level 2. Yeah, you know what? He wasted all of his, if I even lose this fight, I can still come back, because I have all my ability cards, and I don't have to worry about him at all. I don't even know who got that. Was that me? Okay, wasting that. Oh. I didn't even get the 1400. Oh well. When a back of guns too powerful and you even try to use all your ability cards. Well, I feel like I've won this battle already. <laughs> Alrighty, um, so let's see. 
So this card would be more useful for my Drago than Leonidas, even though Leonidas would still be helpful, so... Putting this for Leonidas would probably be for the best, so I'll put that here. The next turn I'll place the next card down for uh, Drago. Or if I want to be ballsy and go uh, somewhere else. Yeah. <laughs> then the most strongest of the back are gone. There we go, I got them all this time. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'll take that, honestly. I was going to go over and maybe grab some more stuff to the side, but if I just land on the card, then that's fine, too. Rock is actually a pretty good uh, one to have, too. Oh, jeez, he's, he's going in with Tentaclear. Well, I hate to tell you this, but I think you're going to lose. Now watch, just because I have, like, since all my Bakugan are all different attributes, watch what this card does. It gives me a 200 bonus from uh, what it is. So, if you guys don't know what this card is, each Bakugan used by a player who is using all different types of attributes gets 200 uh, G power, 2 extra G power, and since he's using nothing but uh, Chaos Bakugan, he doesn't get any bonus. Um, I don't think this card would be effective if um, you have at least a Bakugan with the same attribute. Like, e even if one of them is different and two of them are the same, it won't work. Trust me, I've tried that with like, try to go in with like Diablo, Drago, and Tigera. It didn't work. <laughs> But yeah, all the bronze cards have uh, different effects, which are very handy. Even though they have like one of the hardest mini games, though. But I'm confident now. <laughs> I'm only 400 ahead, but there's also the case that I know what um, game is coming up next. And it's Shaking Battle Level 3. It's not my favorite. Eh, if he catches up, I have the Croc Stopper. I don't want to use it right away, but if I have to. Okay. Okay, good circle. Circle's the best. Side to side. God damn it. What the hell? I'm actually doing good on side to side. Eighteen sixty-two to a thousand five three. In fact, I just needed to shake a little bit, and I would have been fine. <laughs> it wasn't even close to beating me. Nice, I won again. Well, if you insist, I'm gonna place that there, have it for Drago, and then your toast. You even used up Tentaclear as well. Oh jeez, Drago moves fast as well. Him and Tigger, I swear to god. I just kinda did the same thing like Leonidas. Alright, come on, come fight me. He did. <laughs> he come he came at me all three times. <laughs> he fell into my trap cards. Delta Dragonoid. Well, get fucked. Even though I'm only able to use two of them, it's still freaking good. You had a 150, which is almost to a thousand, and then what Ro Russian roulette will get? <laughs> 255. Not bad. Still would prefer something around the 300s, but uh. I wish I could grab that. <laughs> Whatever. Time in battle level 3. Oh, watch how much of a dick I can be.
Boom, 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 boom. 1529 to 506. Bye, Julio. Yes, I won. That's my skills talking. You have such an OP team like me. Yeah, see, like, the destruction reward is now times four because I hit it four times during that. And then back we got defeated rewards. Those are all the different ones. Um. Gate card reward times three, yeah. Uh, battlefield reward, yeah. Um, also, the harder the battlefield, the more points you get as well. Like on the Aquas field, I think it's like 200 maybe, or 250. On the Subterra field, it's like 500, and then, you know, 750 for this one. I think Pyrus is 1,000, and then. 1,200 on Chaos, and then 1,500 on Darkest Field? I don't know. But, uh, yeah. That's pretty much how it goes. Who's my next opponent? Eh. 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 Ah, you're funny. <laughs> Honestly, she's one, like, her and Akira are probably the worst for this kind of, uh, field, because they don't have a ba partner Bakugan, so that's, the, like, they don't really have a strong Bakugan on their squad. I might just make up an easy deck for next time, just so I have a bit more of a challenge. You know what, I'll, I'll change it on this deck, I'll go here, and then I'll change it up here, see what we get. Uh, let's see. Actually, you know, before I do that, let's... Uh, what what character cards do I even have? I have a Saurus card. Uh, I mean, maybe I'll use one of the normal Bakugan, I guess. I mean... That's a pretty girl. Yeah, I think something for just normal Drago seems fine, so I'll do that, and then, uh, maybe a mixture of everything else. I'll keep this around and do that, because I think also with that might be fine, too. And I do have this one, cool. And yeah, that would work, too. Uh, not that. Let's see. What well, card really sucks for Subterra? I mean, that kind of does, but, mm. if I put that for Chaos, I guess it would work. Once again, for Chaos, that would work. That's more handy for some of the other Bakugan. I think I'll do that, yeah. Uh, and then that's fine, and everything else is fine. Okay, and then we'll switch up the Bakugan. What other Aquas Bakugan do I have? Not much. See, the thing is, I also don't want to go with Preus because he can also change up his attribute. And you are not powerful enough. I guess I'll just go with Sirenoid, I guess. I wanted to try to use, like, different Bakugan and stuff. So I guess I'll keep you there. Um, I definitely gotta go with Drago. Huh, they're on the same, uh, as well. And then I want Chaos. At least some sort of Chaos Bakugan. Chigura. Um, Tentaclear. Maybe no, I mean, not too bad. Yeah, why not? I'll put, like, Ravenoid. Just so we have a normal Bakugan on our team as well. You know what, even before I go into the battle, which we're not going to start till next episode, but so you guys know my strategy for next time, um, I will go and upgrade uh, Ravenoid a little bit. Because I do want to grab like a bunch of different types of Bakugan as well. So let's see. You're level 5 as well. 
speed, defense, acceleration, they're all eh. endurance and jump. That's fun, I guess. Is complete. Yeah, I'll well, upgrade you once at least. Get you ready. You Shouldn't be that much of a threat, but you know, it's uh, jewels in the Ventus field, so what do you expect? So, uh... anyways, I'm gonna leave this uh, episode here. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed, and in the next video, we will continue on our little adventure. So, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you guys like this video, press like button or subscribe, do whatever, and I'll see how you do it in the next video. See you next time.